up, I'm just picky and bitchy. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't film very good in the dark. Turn the fucking light back on. <laughs> <laughs> I hate feeling like I'm on a stage, even though I'm actually on a stage. Sit on the stage. Yeah, he's, tell he's filming now. Um, I was thinking about this, because this is one I wanted to read, but I forgot about it. And if you're wondering about the quote on the quote wall that says, Jesus didn't wear pants... <laughs> That's where this came from. Yay! I love this. It's very exciting. Because yes. Jesus didn't wear fucking pants. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay. It's, from, it's also from rap. Like, this whole freaking book is from rap. But, um, uh, the prompt was, we don't do that here. <laughs> the silence in the auditorium was deafening. In the way that only silence can be. I sit, mid-pew, alone, my ugly skirt touching the floor. <clears throat> If anybody asked, I was reflecting. But really, I was plotting revenge. Revenge in the, in the way that only an eight-year-old mind can process revenge. I will, I will, I will buy a whole box of them and wear them all the time! <laughs> I said feebly into the dusty air. Up on the wall, Jesus looked down scornfully. I just wanted to wear a tie. Yes, a men's tie. On dress-up day. The polite yet scolding, Honey, we don't do that here. Girls don't wear neckties came down like a sentence of impending doom. My eight year old self had not crumbled. Instead, stiffened, stood upright, scowled, and walked away. Well, men weren't supposed to wear dresses either, but all the pictures I'd ever seen of Jesus, he wasn't wearing pants, so what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> the next weekend, on a trip to my grandfather's house, I stole away into his closet. The musty old smell conjuring thoughts of times past before my mind could comprehend. I touched lightly the rack of ties, put one silently, one, silently one in my pocket, my own forbidden piece of masculinity. Mm -hmm. Woo! Yeah.